Hey, good afternoon, everybody. This is the professor with Day Trading for Success. I wanted to get out uh, um, the new scalping indicator to our uh, the people that have been following me along and then show you what I've done with the new custom scripts. I did work on them this morning before I uh, reveal them and talk to you about a little bit. Um, make sure you read this disclaimer. I am not a licensed financial advisor. You should seek the advice of someone you trust uh, before you do any type of trading that I show you here. Uh, emulate anything. Use any of these custom scripts. You know, get speak to somebody licensed and trade in a simulator first and make sure things are working for you. So read that. So I did trade NVIDIA earlier today uh, just for the open strategy and did okay. Um, and the open strategy has just been amazing. Obviously, I'll have a link to that book along with all the other books. That's not what this video is about. But I wanted to go into, you, uh, into this new scalping indicator that what I've done here is there used to be a, this is the one change here. There used to be a 50 moving average, volume moving average here. And now I have added, uh, I have done it to, to coincide with the charts, to kind of coincide with the other script that I just did for the Million Dollar Margin Club up here. So this now has a 5-minute, 15-minute, 30-minute, and 1-hour moving averages of the volume. So you can... Um, Besides just having all, if you first time you've ever seen this indicator that I'm giving away for free here on this channel, it's really the best scalping indicator that there is. The red lines represent the sellers, the green lines the buyers, and the blue is the volume. So at any given uh, moment, you can see the momentum of a stock, and then up here it gives the actual percentages inside the candlestick at the very moment you're seeing it, as well as the close of the last candle and then the current candle that's going on right now. Um, and then I just kind of pulled that up so you could see it better there. But this is newer because it only had a 50, and I noticed it was missing yesterday when I put out the video um, uh, uh, over the weekend. So I went back in, and not only did I... Uh, find that I'd loaded an older version, but I decided to make it better to kind of go along with what you're seeing up here, which is this one that we talked about earlier. And what I've done is, if you were watching yesterday's video, I would recommend watching the one that I put out the episode just before this, because it has a lot of detail about these types of scripts. What I've done up here, guys, is under the dashboard, I'm, I, sh I, I realized you couldn't see this very well, uh, so I made my picture a little smaller for, the, for this video, but um, under the dashboard, uh, it has all the information it has down here, but it also has um, bid, ask, and spread, and now it has wh what the last five-minute candle closed at. It was up. The last 15 minute closed up, the last 30 minute closed up, but then the one hour and the four hour closed down. And it shows you when they're closing as the candlestick action is coming up to them. So what we call this is multi-chart alignment. So rather than having all these different charts open at once, like a 15 minute, a one hour, 30 minute, you know, I have them minimized down here. So, you know, they, they open up to do my, to do set up for the RV strategy or the open strategy. Um, but um, now on your one minute uh, uh, chart when you're trading, you, you, know, you can see very quickly when a whole bunch of other traders are about to make their decision. So you can see that just closed. It, it bopped another one ahead. You know, it, it, it's on a 15 minute that just closed. So the 15 minute is going back and forth right now. You can see it was red a second ago. Uh, the, but the 30 minute close green. So this is really good information to have if you understand, if you're looking for a perfect entry or an exit or short or long. Not only do you have in the moment data down here, it's, re it's repeating up here. So you don't have to look all over the screen. This you're going to want to read the histogram with right but then these if you're not looking at the histogram every moment you can instantly see what the sentiment is inside the candle as well as the bid ask and the spread and then now this is telling you i mean there's not i've never done a script quite this detailed i'm pretty happy with it um this is going to the million dollar margin club so you've got to see them about how to get this particular one uh the the dashboard and the this one here uh, but I will put the, this one, the brand new one of this, for free on this video. 
Um, so you can get that. But I wanted to go over why you see this, because I think this is going to be free to you as well. I think what they're after mostly is just book reviews. So they, if you, I, I don't want to speak for them, but they'll pro they're making a video to um, launch this and this. And yes, I did do them, but I'm giving them to the Million Dollar Margin Club. So um, if there's any question there, they're going to have the rights to this and this. And, uh, and then I'm using, I let them do this too, but uh, the deal was um, that I always got to uh, give this away free to my viewers. This, I don't, I can't imagine a better indicator than this right here. So, and I just so you know, I did try to merge these for you guys, but this is gonna be free for you anyway, so don't panic. Um, and, um, but what happens is these blue columns go wherever the candlesticks go because it would be really cool if you could read them right with the candlesticks you know, like right below it but thinkorswim isn't at this point doesn't allow me to do that i had them on the phone and i tried to change things just like i'm trying to work on a level two um actual histogram uh to show that and it, it's just it's not it's not, it's not, it's not easy, but I have made some, some ground on this over the last six months. So, uh, but there's certain things in, inside their internal way that they set up this, um, platform that doesn't allow for what I'm trying to do. So what's going to happen is I think, um, it's going to randomize it and try to make the best possible guess based on the information and randomize it. And sometimes that's, good enough it's like that old thing in star trek that a, that a guess from spock is usually better than the other people just knowing that sometimes a guess is better so randomizing a guess on level two sort of like the heat map or whatever um that's on a histogram might be that last little bit of data that we need but these are pretty good um work work working in conjunction i i don't think you're going to have much trouble. So I'm going to label this um, free uh, scalpers indicator and information on other custom scripts. Um, right now, you can still get a lot of other free scripts on this channel. Just type in free scripts and you'll you'll find them as well as look for the links to the, you know, Mark Douglas is trading in the zone and Tom Hogarth's best loser win and the million dollar margin clubs four volumes of trading. Um, you know, all those books is great if you want to get those. Now, let me talk to you about this five minute chart because I wanted to show you something that's important. Hopefully you're still all here and listening to the rest of this. So let me maximize this. So now this is over on a five minute chart. So how was I able to do that? And I'll show you the way that I have this um, uh, design, right? You go into this. Oh, no, not that. Yeah, this one, right? When you get this one, right? And then you can set this for right here over the aggregated period that you want. So you can actually set that dashboard once they give it to you over there for any time frame you want, which is really cool. So you can have a dashboard on every chart on Thinkorswim. And yes, I will be doing it for TradingView for those of you that are asking. I'm just catching up over here because I've had a little bit more time to work on the script. So um, I just wanted you to know that. So on a five minute, there's a lot of people that only trade on five minutes. When you have RSI, MACD, I'm also doing a Bollinger Band one. And I'm, I'm working on a whole bunch. I don't want to... Um, out at all yet, but I'm doing a whole bunch of d different scripts that hopefully uh, will really, really help day traders turn a profit, which is what day trading for success is all about. So, and I'm a uh, million dollar margin club has sort of contracted me to do these things. Otherwise, I just, you know, as long as they can be made available to people without them spending lots of money like we're like all those other places. So, for the most part, I think everything's going to be free. They're looking for support for what they do so um and on their channel which is million hyphen dollar hyphen margin club and they put out and talk about a lot of good books and reviews so they're a really good channel to support in my opinion um, and they have a website too um, i would i would check them out and they haven't even monetized yet you know because there's so so many um not enough uh, viewing hours and things. So, you know, they're very, very beginning, moving very slowly. And I'm hoping to kind of give them 
by doing these scripts, I'm hoping I'm kind of going to give them the boost to get a following so that more people get into logging and, um, you know, using the books. They're going to have the, you know, the power of the force indicator over there. Uh, they can't say it's from Star Wars. They're going to have the prayer indicator over there. Uh, so they're going to, besides just books now that help people trade, now they're going to have um, all these custom indicators that are going to help people trade. And yes, I will be the designer, but I'm not taking credit on the on on them. That's fine. I enjoy I enjoy doing it. And I think the reciprocation between the two uh, channels and other channels are actually getting involved too is going to be as long as it's helping people you know traders that's what i uh i want to see happen i'm not so altruistic that i don't want any kind of monetization i'm not saying that i'm just saying that is that it is the mission statement that basically day trading for success is is about so uh without any further ado i'll i'll also make this layout available one more time um and then um this should this these will not be here I can't believe how many questions already I got about yesterday's video. How do I get this? How, how, you know, you didn't you didn't put that because I said I wasn't doing it. You weren't watching. You don't watch. You people, you got to watch the video. This is not a very long video. Watch the video, uh, and then you know eventually you'll get all the stuff that you want with probably paying nothing. So just give it a chance. Maybe invest a little bit of your time watching. Everybody wants it now, 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 and doesn't want to do anything. You know, so, um, and I get it. I understand. I can't change the world. But I think this is going to be really cool, too, having these being able to watch the volume over time. Because what you're really looking for, and I haven't used it that much yet, but you're going to see me trade with it. You're looking for crossovers in volume for breakout. So, you know, it's cool that it's showing you in another way what the, when these when the furthest one out crosses over you know the fastest one crosses over i think the chartreuse here is the five minute um this green is the uh 15 minute this um this is the 30 minute down here and uh um, i think the yellow is the one hour so um yeah but yeah that's all of them so so i think that's it but i'll know for sure when i make a video trading with it so you guys can see I probably won't trade with these yet until they're out over there um, so people aren't screaming at me. How do I get these? But um, I'm, not, I'm not, for me, I'm really used to using this and this adding these volumes really are going to be so amazing. And I like these, um, the multi-time line. I'm not, for me personally, I'm not 100% sold on watching my bid and ask and spread here because that's the only thing it's really adding uh, to this because I'm so used to looking at the market maker which this is not telling me what the market maker price is so I'm working on trying to get that here uh, the market maker price um, but if I can get that in there I'd be more inclined to to use it but you see how I trade if I'm trading market. I'm looking at this number, you know, not that I, I do look at the bid and the ask. I do. But if you're trading large cap, it doesn't matter as much. Right. So um, it's, it's I mean, it doesn't come into play as much. It still matters, but it just it, it can't tell you I should do it now like it does on on micro and small and even mid caps. These these bunched up numbers, these are all multiplied by 100 and um, I think somebody asked me a question. I'll answer it right now. Like, can you really hide? I think it was you, Chuck. Can you really hide um, your, your, um, your bid and ask? Can you really hide these numbers if you were trading? Not on Thinkorswim, you can't. On Lightspeed, you can. I do believe there are other platforms that let you hide your trade completely. Um, but Thinkorswim is not one at this point. I wish they would. But it is not one right now to answer that question, Chuck. Um, anyway, guys, um, that's it. Yeah, I just wanted to pop on real quick because of the amount of questions and emails I'm getting about these. So they are a hit. I still would love to have feedback. Please give me feedback if you like this or you think it's too busy. Um, you know, these, these volume uh, based on, on, the, on the most commonly used charts, which are 5, 15-minute, 30-minute, and 1-hour. 
um, so we can see, you know, you can see how this is telling you short term move. It's, it's going to go down. Let's see the volume. Now, that's just the volume, not the price. But what you do is you line up the price. You follow this line up. You know, you have the price with the volume, just like this is doing. So it takes a little bit of getting used to it, but it's telling you right there, this is going down, you know, and uh, it, you can jump on that short-term move really quick and make some money. Now it's slowing down. It was going down for a bit. But uh, most of you that have been following know what I'm talking about because how, how I trade these. But I thought it was cool that it could go to any chart, too, so I'm repeating myself. Okay, guys, um, that's it. Remember, trade in a simulator. Uh, give me some feedback on this. I will make this available right now on this video, again, with this layout. And then uh, go get over to the Million Dollar Margin Club so you can follow subscribe to them so you can follow when they're releasing the other ones I'm doing for them um, because this this is a game changer here this one here is a game changer so um, I you know for me anyway the multi-chart alignment because the other one I had was slowing down my platform and this of course is much better so I'm really spending the time now to get to get into this like I like I used to do a long time ago, but not for trading stocks. So anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Be careful out there trading the sim. Stay green. Go green, guys.